to watch me. You just can't seem to get yourself started. This time. This time. This time. This time. This, 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 this time. Oh, ow! Ah! Ah! It seems like the whole world's out to get you. Oh, and the commute. At least there's always breakfast. Nothing makes morning right like a McDonald's savory sausage breakfast sandwich hot off the griddle and a premium roast coffee made the way you take it. Ah, sweet nectar. Hello, me folks, and welcome to another toy review. Today's toy review is Bees, the Bee Movie toy from McDonald's back in 2007. Um... Good old toy review again, guys. So, yeah, I have, um, five toys here, but I am missing one. I've been meaning to do this video a long time ago, but I needed to collect the last one for me to make this video, which was this guy. This guy is really bloody hard to find. Uh, might as well start with him, because he's the heart. Oh, my God, this guy in... And, uh, this guy really hard to find. Oh, my God. Um, like, this guy's the easiest guy to find. But, like, jeesh, like, that, oh, this one's, like, a pain in the bum. I found this on the street. And, holy crap, was it hard to find. Um, it was on the side of the road. And I cleaned it up. Uh, it was all dirty. Um, all the creases and, um, bends in the face were all filled with dirt. Um, I had to, uh, do a little cleaning. So, yeah, um, as you can see, it's a wound-up toy, and it's got these wings, which are all bloody bent, and one of the problems with those, with these toys is it's got bad wings, and these antenna things, I don't think I'm a big fan of these antenna things. I'm actually really not a big fan of them. They need to be cut shorter. Like, it just makes him look like something creepy. But I think this is a meme. I think this dancing bee one is a meme. I'm not quite sure. I think I've also reviewed it on a treasure review video. I'm not quite sure, but I probably have. But yeah. So let's get to the mechanism. I'll wound it up and get it started. And we'll have a look at it. Okay, you ready guys? Three, two, one. Alright, so that was it. It still works pretty damn well. Let's make sure it's out. So it's, uh, what it does is it, its arms move with the, um, uh, the wound up. So, yeah. It's pretty much plastic mold. Nothing special. The paint job is, is okay. Uh, comparing to the mo B movie, it's, it's spick on. Um, but yeah, let's move on to the next one at number two. We have, um, this guy, I forget the names of the, uh, bees. Um, this guy's voiced by a guy that, um, plays on a, uh, 80s show, I forget, I forget, it's a comedy show, but it's got, like, a funny song that's, uh, our ending or our starting of the show, so, yeah. Uh, Benson, I think? Benson? I think. Uh, but, uh, there's his blue eyes. Um, this one is one of my first ones I ever got. Um, it has a button, but it doesn't work anymore, sadly, so the voice, he doesn't say it. But he, I think he would say, uh, hi, or something like that. But, you can move his arms. He's got a little bit of movement to him. Uh, you can make him do a fist punch. Uh, you can make him sit. Uh, really, nothing special. Um, it's pretty, uh, it's very a basic toy. At least it isn't a stiff mold, because uh, once the, uh, batteries die, it is really just a piece of garbage if you have a mold that's a toy. So, yeah. Uh, he's got nice, uh, the gla glasses. That's movie. That's, uh, accurate to the movie. Um, I if I can get it. You know what, I'll just let him fall over. And we'll move on to the next one. At number three, we have is my second oldest. Uh, this is, uh, oh, I forget the guy's name. Um, he's a nerd, for sure. 
Um, again, this one's got a wind a wound up to it. Um, and I will pause it and uh, wind it up in a minute. Uh, but he's got a a nice suit on, and he's dancing just like the other one. But his arms, his arms are just uh, movable. They're posable. Um, I think it's his legs this time that, uh, do the moving. Um, but yeah, he's in good, he's good, he's in good, uh, shape. I have two of these guys because I got, I found one in Tellies, so. Yeah, I'm not gonna show that one here, but. Yeah, I'm gonna pause the video and wind him up, and yeah. Ready in three, two, one. No, uh, and this one, this one, wind up doesn't work very well. Alright, guys. Oh, he's still going. Alright, just making sure he's out. Doing a little dance. Gotcha. Alright, so we'll move on to the next one at number four. We have the Mosquito. Um, the Rad Mosquito. Um, from the wiper scene. The wind, oh, the wind car thing or whatever. Um... This guy was really hard to find as well. Um, I got him at Telly's. All, all the old stuff you can get at Telly's, but I stopped going there because it, you can't find any more McDonald's stuff there. Um, because all this new McDonald's crap is coming in. Uh, so, yeah, he's got a hollow, um, tail. I hate mosquitoes. Uh, but this, this character is okay. Um, again, it's a wind up. So, let me get it wound it up, and, yeah. Let it in three, two, one. So, it vibrates rapidly and moves. So, that's pretty cool. Um, at number, at our last one, we have the, um, guys that patrol the area and look for nectar. Um... He's got his nice glass, uh, glasses, but you can't take that off, which would, is pretty sad. Again, it's a wound up, and it does the exact same thing. Let's, we'll take a look at it. Um, so, pretty, pretty movie, um, correct? Uh, not much to say about it. It moves its legs, its arms, you can do it, make it have the, uh, Superman pose. Uh, but yeah. I will pause the video and get it all wound it up. Let it off in three, two, one. I don't think that's how bees are supposed to move. That sounded more like a lawnmower and the bee didn't move properly. So yeah, there you have it guys, all the B-movie toys except one, which would be the cockroach or the, or the, the bug, but whatever. Uh, if I get it, I will remake this video, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video, subscribe, comment, and like, and bye for now.